Dr. Drew, every weeknight, 9 Eastern on HLN. Lisa Bloom now joins us. As I said, she is author of this new book. It is called Swagger. It's a book that looks at why boys in our society are failing in such large numbers. What's the theory? Well, there's a lot going on. One of the big problems is education. Boys are suspended, disciplined, and expelled at four times the rate of girls, even as young as preschool. So many girls, many boys get the message very young, three or four years old. I'm not really welcome in school. I'm not appreciated in school. I don't like school. I don't want to go back. Boys don't read nearly as much as girls do. So girls outperform boys in reading in every grade in every state in this country, 50 so, states. So, well, are you laying the blame on the educational system or the parents? Well, it's not really about blame. What I talk about are the four cultural forces that are hammering boys, our failing schools, our terrible economy right now where young men in particular have very high unemployment rates, mm -hmm. thug culture, a lot of media messages that encourage boys to be violent, to attack women, to beat up gay men, certainly to be emotionally numb. And the fourth one is mass incarceration, where we incarcerate four times as many boys today as we did when I was a girl. Are they four times worse? Certainly not. But we've criminalized a whole class of behavior. One of the things so I talk about in the book both, is that boys levels. have to be reading effectively by fourth grade. If they're not, they're going to do poorly in all subjects, and they're highly likely to drop out of high school, be unemployed, and have all of these terrible problems that young men are facing right now. It's absolutely critical that boys read by the fourth grade. In the book, I show parents how to do that. But role modeling that reading is a pleasure, taking out a book after dinner is critically important. That's got to be hard now with so many of the boys that are growing up into adults to be now parents who have been affected by this drought right. of education. Right. They don't know what that is. So you nailed it. It is so important for fathers to be good role models for their sons. And not, I'm, you know, that's such a general statement. What does that mean? It means take your son to a cultural event. Take him to a book event or a political rally or a bookstore. But show him that you love reading.